One of the best advancements in connection technology in Audi vehicles is the ability to use your own compatible phone as the operating system of the MMI, giving you access to select apps and streaming services. This helps make using the interface more intuitive since you use it in much the same way you currently use your smartphone for accessing music, navigation, and other applications. Before beginning a connection to a compatible Android phone, you must first download the Android Auto app from the Google Play Store. To connect, the vehicle must be stationary with the ignition on. Your Android smartphone must be connected with a manufacturer-approved cable to the USB port in the console. Aftermarket cables may not be able to handle the data transfer necessary for Android Auto to work properly. Once connected, you will see a connection prompt in the MMI. Press the control knob to activate Android Auto and respond to other prompts as necessary, such as the agreement for data transfer. Also, respond to prompts on your smartphone as necessary, including access to directories and messages. Finally, accept the safety disclaimer in the MMI. When Android Auto activates for the first time, you can watch a brief tutorial on the available features. Turn the control knob to progress through the pages. It provides a nice overview of using Android Auto. Once the setup is complete, the Android Auto homepage will appear with the basic function icons in the lower edge of the frame. Shift the control knob down to access the functions and turn the knob to select navigation, phone, audio, or Audi MMI functions. The circle in the middle provides you with information about active apps and location-based data. Press to select a function. To use Google Voice, press and hold the talk button on the steering wheel until you hear a confirmation tone. Then speak your command. What is the weather forecast for tomorrow? Tomorrow's forecast for Winter Park is 84 degrees and partly cloudy. You can use Google Voice to make and receive calls, send and receive text messages, set reminders, get turn-by-turn -turn navigation, listen to music, explore Google Maps, and any of the functions you would normally do with your Android. It's simply a matter of telling Google what you want. Where is the nearest gas station? When using the Android Auto Navigation System, you will access Google Maps for route guidance to a specific address or types of places and points of interest. Give me directions to 3800 Hamlin Road, Auburn Hills. Other functions of Android Auto are simple and intuitive. To make a call, simply tell Google who you want to call from your phone's contact directory. Call home. If you want to call a number that isn't in your contact directory, you can enter it manually using the speller or take advantage of the Audi touchpad to write the numbers with your fingertip as you would in the native MMI system. To access music, press the talk button, wait for the tone, and say what you want to hear. You do not need to select the app first. Play freestyle. You can also control tracks verbally. Play next track. You can also pause and resume music playback simply by tapping the touchpad or the control knob. The Audi console interface provides you with additional ways to access features. Shift the control knob left to open settings within an app. To start voice recognition, shift it to the right. You can access your other audio apps within the audio selection by shifting the control knob down. This will show your available audio apps like Pandora, Spotify, Audible, and any others that you have residing on your phone. If you have accessed another MMI function while in Android Auto and want to return to the Android Auto display, press the menu button, then turn the control knob and select Android Auto. Android Auto remains active in the background even while using MMI functions. If a device is not properly connected or if you're connected to a device not compatible with Android Auto functions, when you select the Audi smartphone interface, you will receive a prompt indicating this. You can then select the connection manager. You will see a list of available devices and their status. Find your Android phone and select it. Android Auto will now be displayed. To disconnect from Android Auto, simply unplug the cable. Or if you want to leave your smartphone connected but disconnect it electronically, select the main menu, then Settings, then choose Connection Manager. Find your device in the list and deselect it by removing the check mark. Your system will now revert to Audi MMI functions. With the Audi smartphone interface using Android Auto, you can have the best of both worlds, a comprehensive set of applications and media connectivity features built into the MMI, along with the portability and familiarity of your compatible smartphone's operating system. 
This is Audi Technology at Work.